for black folks and black celebrities like Michael Jackson. We, you know, we didn't even touch on the Michael Jackson we didn't issue. Even talk, we you didn't know, know my, talk, Michael Jackson. Jackson you know, Michael Jackson dead. Ain't that something? We we live to see Michael Jackson quote dead end quote. You know what I mean? Yeah, that was shocking. I mean, but shocked. But then I realized. You know what I said to people, and they, they were shocked to hear me say it. I said they got him. You know what? You need to go on on my channel and check out um, check out they 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 killed and they they killed and crucified Michael Jackson. I did a I did a whole set of videos on um, on on Michael Jackson at that time because I was right after a couple of weeks after my my earthly father had passed away after he died. You know and. So it was in the same kind of vein. I'm like, wow, look at that. You know, maybe they needed some musicians on the other side. They needed some entertainment, you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, but um, now I'm his sister. I'll definitely post some things and tell you what I think, and then we can read it on that if you're here or if I call you. Yeah, yeah. Well, well, his sister, Michael Jackson's sister, even has come out and said that she believes it was murder. I don't know whether it's from my video or others or whatever like that. But she believes that there was some, um, there was some foul play. But whenever you see Joe, whenever you see Joe, Joe Jackson, on TV or whatever like that, look at that Africa pendant. You see the Africa pendant he be wearing a lot. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm like, what? What's up with that? What's up with that? You you give some money to Africa cause, you know, you you down with the Africa house. What's up? You know, line of Jew society. You know, we need some money to do the work that we need to do to continue Michael Jackson's work of reaching out to the people. Cause definitely. One thing about Michael Jackson, you understand, even though he had his own strangeness, but that's all part of, because he, he, was, he, he was young when he was sold to the plantation, when he was sold into Egypt. He, he, he was, he, he wasn't, you know, back in the day, a lot of the rosters and reggae artists didn't like him, especially after Thriller. They, 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 they didn't, or did, they did or they didn't? They didn't, because when he started stringing in his hair, and there was even a song like Mackie B, uh, I think about that. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, well, because of those cultural reasons. But you have to remember that Michael Jackson, and and you know, I I said this before I even knew his name. His middle name was Joseph. I said, you know, the interesting thing about Michael Jackson, he reminded me of Joseph in a sense. He reminded me of Joseph that was sold into Egypt. You understand? And who who sold Joseph into Egypt? It was his brothers. Go back to the Pepsi commercial. That, that where he burned his hair. Now they're showing it. Actually, you've seen that, right? The, the 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 hair burning incident and everything like that. He didn't want to do that Pepsi commercial because he first of all didn't drink Pepsi. He didn't like carbonated drinks, so forth and so on. He didn't want to do it, but his brothers, you understand, know wanted to do it. So they kept begging him, begging him to do it. And I think his moms or pops basically also put that pressure. So he So he eventually did it. You understand? Know because of them. So it starts to remind me of Joseph. You remember Joseph in the Bible? You know, it's like the whole story of Joseph. And remember, there was a lot of Egyptian... That's, that's, a, great, that's a great parallel, man. You know, it, it is. But, but the thing about it is that when I heard that Michael Jackson's middle name is Joseph, it's like me and the sister was talking about it. The sister in Florida, we was talking about it on the phone, right? And I said it's the same thing, that he reminded me of Joseph, sold into slavery, sold into the plantation, the Egypt, the spiritual Egypt, so forth and so on. Lightning straight in his head, the confusion, so forth and so on. He's the cash cow for his family and for the industry, so forth and so on, right? And he, since he was a young boy, remember he was a young boy, similar to the whole Joseph story, Technicolor coat, the coat of many colors. He was a talented one. His whole family had to kind of bow to him, but the brothers and maybe the father and maybe the others didn't really want to bow to him, almost like the same thing as Joseph. They wanted to kill him maybe at first, but they said, nah, why kill him? You know, we could make some money off him. So Judah, you know, had decided to sell him to the Ishmaelites, to the Arabs, to the Arabs, the Ishmaelites in the Bible. Now look at when he went over to Bahrain. He went over to Bahrain, the Arab Emirates, the whole rumor came out, and maybe there's some truth to it because his brother is a Muslim, Jermaine is a Muslim, some truth came to that he became a Muslim too. And on the internet, if you go on the YouTube, you can look up Michael Jackson like Islamic song, you understand? It sounds just like Michael Jackson, but it's said to be this guy Zayn Bikri or something like that. Uh, uh, Arab singer who, who who sings his voice sounds a lot like Michael Jackson. When you hear it, you will really think that oh, this must be Michael Jackson. So th there's that rumor going around. You understand? So from so on. Then the rumor came out that he fired all of his all of his um, 
recent people and he came back to LA after being outside the country in the Middle East and in Africa and South America you understand know doing videos like they don't care about us so forth and so on remember it was Michael Jackson who brought back in a sense black Egyptology black Egyptology all yeah, these folks video, yeah. uh -huh, all these folks that talk about black Egypt and you know niggas Nubians or whatever into Egyptology they need to thank Michael Jackson and recognize he was their Joseph but then look at this about Joseph Joseph was sold into slavery Joseph is the one who kind of was protecting his people you understand yet they didn't even recognize him remember the, the, the thing about Joseph is that his brothers thought that he was an Egyptian they didn't recognize him it's just like how black folks didn't recognize Michael Jackson all these years they're like that's not the Michael Jackson I know I don't recognize who that is this is the Michael Jackson that I know you know what I mean so they didn't recognize him and I think he got a big um, a big uh, a big fight when he did the video that uh, do you remember the time had Imani you understand as the Nefertiti had 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 uh, Eddie Murphy you understand as as the I think Ramses looking like a Ramses the crown that he wore like a Ramses kind of aura mold kind of um, headgear and everybody in that video was black can you now imagine if he were to go on a 50 day world a 50 concert world tour and plus Sir Paul McCartney let me just say this Sir Paul McCartney I believe he has something to do with it or he benefits something from it oh, he, but, did. he bought the rights because Michael bought the Beatles uh, remember he bought yeah the yeah he bought the publishing the publishing rights yeah, and everything like that ex ex exactly ex remember it's not even Paul it's Sir Paul he was knighted he, he, he's been knighted by the Queen of England that means that in the Queen of England's Masonic eyes he plays some role in extending this whole kind of white supremacy this whole kind of Babylonism yeah, you, you see what I'm saying I never forget when Mick Jagger got knighted I, I never thought I would see that you know like Keith Richards goes those are the same people he's part of the system that because they used to persecute them for drugs and all the British pop stars. Yeah, but that was all smokescreen. For black folks and black celebrities like Michael Jackson.